you are doing this person. I told you, baby, I will take you out. Look, so change. This is the local government. This is not the local government. Okay, because I know that place now. It's Sabi in the city. Yes. No wonder. Hi, Sabi. Hello. 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 hi guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here my name is esther Opo. i'm a nigerian youtuber and i'm based in calabar if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do well to subscribe now and to all my amazing returning subscribers thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos you don't know how much you mean to me in today's video i made a trip from lagos to oshobo um this is my first time visiting Oshobo so it took me about four hours I made a train trip from Lagos to Ibadan then I made a road trip from Ibadan to Oshobo that trip cost me the trip to um, the road trip from Ibadan to Oshobo cost me about 1500 naira we departed for Oshobo and um, at some point our vehicle got bad we're lucky that our driver was able to fix it in no time and we finally arrived with Oshobo save i headed straight to Nike guest house or Fatado Oshobo i hope i said that right where i'll be staying uh, so i'm currently at Nike guest house Oshobo so I'll just show you what it looks like here. First, I got in here last night, so I couldn't really do a thing. So I just said if I wake up this morning, I'll just show you guys around. It's really, really a nice place with trees, very quiet. Right now, well, just about two of us here. This is Nike Guest House Oshobo. Let's do a mini tour. It is quite colorful around here. The painting and also the environment is very serene. Do you need some peace and quiet? Then this place is for you. It was just myself and one other guest on this day. Should I say this guest house is made up of two buildings? This one and there's another one down there. The one down there has rooms costing 5,000 naira and they have no AC and this one in here costs 7,000 naira with ACs let's go in and see what they have this is what the living room area looks like um, I like the colorful fabrics on the couch the window blinds and the curtains everywhere just looks pretty much colorful and there's this register for you to sign in and sign out whenever you visit the guest house. And also a second living room, lots of arts on the wall, more arts and um, some rooms in between. Let's proceed to my room where I'll be passing the night. I got this room for 7,000. It has two beds. So in case you have a plus one or you have a friend, so you can share this room with them. It has the Nikkei signature all over. That is the colorful duvets, the bed sheets, the curtains, the window blinds. I think I just love everything about this place i don't know if you like this part but there's a bathroom and toilet right inside the room <laughs> but there's also a bathroom and toilet outside just in case you're not comfortable using the one inside there's a big garden at the back of the house where you can have your picnics people have breakfast here with friends in the morning in the garden it was quite dusty that's why i couldn't sit here so i just had to come look at it then i left
A few moments later. Hi guys. So right about now, I'm heading to Nikkei Arts Gallery. I'll see you guys in a bit. So when I arrived at Nikkei Arts Gallery of Shobo, I met some other guests who so we went in together. We met with Akin and he took us around. There are a lot of beautiful art pieces here and they are all available for sale. Um, the place looks very much old and dusty and um, it has a lot of other sections. Section for beads, fabrics, paintings, mats and a lot of other things. So when we're done from seeing the art gallery, Akin spoke about the Nikkei Batik Center where all the work is done and he said it will cost me just 15 naira on a bike to get there. So um, I decided to visit and see things for myself. What are you doing? This, uh... Different type people have been some people have been using it, they are not. So we have to do it. Well done. I can go in there. Uh, go there. So what is this your drink? Looks like uh, candle something something. Is that what you're doing? Candle wax. Yes. So this is like you're designing this fabric. Yes, exactly. With this color design. Will this candle wax get to leave it? Yes. Like when you wash it. After the waxing, I will have to wax the bottom. Oh, 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 oh. This process like I thought it's like this is all of it. No. Okay, this is like the first process to help dye. When I got there, I met a few people walking and um, I watched them do their thing. And um, they showed me how the, um, the beginning process looks like and then um, I was unlucky to come when they were already done with dying for the day and then um, they said if I could come back the next day but I couldn't so I'll be ending this vlog here um, I hope you learned a thing or two and I hope that when you visit Oshobo this video will help you locate a few places do not forget to subscribe to my channel give this video a thumbs up leave a comment share this video to your friends and your loved ones and i will see you in my next video it's time to go back to the guest house